Hello, happy Thursday. So, today is Thursday, May 16th. Date's important. We have started a new project around here. Technically, I guess we started it last night. Um, we had a company come out and talk to us last night about painting our house. And oh, there we go. Um, and their product and the process and everything. Um, and the company that we're using has been around for over 30 years. Um, I can't remember the name of it. I'll get, I'll get it for you later though. Um, but they've been around for 30 years. They have a special product that they use and a special system they use. And it's supposed to be better than just painting your house. Um, there are two different products. One has a 30 year warranty. The other has a 15 year warranty. And because we have vinyl siding on the front of our house, we ended up having to do the 15 year one because it gets too heavy for the vinyl and the vinyl starts falling off. But it's supposed to reflect the sunshine. So inside will stay cooler during the summer, supposedly. We'll see. Um, waterproof it, which we get lots of rain. Um, keep the bugs in stuff from sticking to it and maybe marks and all kinds of stuff. We'll see if any of it actually happens. Whatever. But they're coming today with samples of the colors we picked last night in a bigger format so we can see how we actually like them. Um, but they want to start like now. Um, he said it'll take four to five days because it's a big project for our house and there's quite a few repairs they need to do before they do everything. Um, so yeah, I'm not quite sure when they're going to start. If it'll be tomorrow or Monday. But they want to get it done before hurricane season starts, which starts June 1st. Um, and we looked at weather for the week and we're not supposed to get much rain so it should be a pretty good good week and get it done and it'll be done before everyone shows up end of the month so i thought i would take you along this process and show you the uh before picture videos pictures show you what the house looks like before and then the after product I'm excited because no more brown. Um, Kevin wanted to just go with what we had, um, change up the, the trim color, but I told him if I'm living with this product for the next 30 years and not having to repaint it, I'm not living with brown. I don't want brown trying to get rid of all the brown and beige in this house. Have his room left. But he hasn't decided what colors he wants his room painted. Ooh. So hopefully everything looks good. Um, so yeah, I guess I will take you outside and show you the before because I need to go take some pictures anyway. Let's go see outside. So here it is from the side of the street. So
So I'm gonna paint this the wall here too. But I'm gonna paint the whole house and the trim and the garage door. Fix things that need to be fixed. Clean everything. Um, they're going to fix the golf ball hole. We take the intercom doorbell out and fix that. Fix the vinyl down there that's coming off. No more ugly brown door. There's a hole up in the vinyl up there from another golf ball they're gonna fix. There are my babies sitting in the window. <laughs> but yeah, it should look pretty different once it's all done. I'm excited. Good evening, happy Tuesday. It is the 21st. I almost forgot, it's getting dark. But progress has been done today. So I'm gonna turn you around and show you what happened. First off, no more golf ball holes. And there was a crack down here that he fixed too. And then he fixed this side. So it's not popped out anymore. But he has to come back and do that one. They forgot to tell him about the one up there. Then, of course, there's this. This is where the old intercom system was. And we've discovered our house is made out of cinder blocks. They didn't know that. Anyway, they're calling around to find someone to do that, but they will be here at 7.30 in the morning to start everything. They got stuff they have to check. They've got cracks and stuff they gotta fix. And then pressure wash, so yeah. Anyway, that's all for tonight. So we will talk to you tomorrow. Bye. Good evening, happy Wednesday. It is the 22nd. I'd like to see what got done today. It looks much different. It's not done. We still have a lot more to do, but it's looking pretty good. I'm not walking all around the house to show you. I'll do that when we're all done. But the garage door looks much better now that it's white. Anyway, oh. And our little wall. They didn't do much to it, but oh, they started on it. They started on it. It's more than once before. But you know it's not. Starting to look pretty good. We got a lot more to do, so I'll show you tomorrow. So bye for now. Good evening. Happy Thursday. It's the twenty-third. And guess what? It's done. So I'm gonna turn you around and show you. Again, I'm not going out back. It's all the same colors. Maybe in a later I'll do it, but I keep getting bit by stuff. I am, I'm not going back out back right now. So I'm gonna turn around, show you the front of the house. There it is. They put some kind of clear coat over all the brick, which makes all the colors pop and it looks it looks wet. It makes it look wet. But here's the front. No more beige. A nice pretty blue front door. They still have to fix that hole up there, but they have to special order the um, vinyl. And then our garage door, all nice and white, looks clean. We need to put our sun back up. 
It looks a little, a little plain without it. And our house numbers are all nice and shiny. And the wall looks much better. I wish we could have done something with the shed, but we've talked that we need, we just want to get a new one. Well, you know what? I'm over here already. I might as well just go in the back way. But yeah. Wait, all the doors back in the back are white. They had this one painted the same color as everything else. And look, more paper. But yeah. And back here looks all nice and clean. And the patio and all the white columns. I think it looks pretty good. It's hard to see, but they even did the chimney way up there. So yeah, overall, it wasn't too bad of an experience. Communication could be slightly better. Um, could have done a little better cleaning up. I've been walking around picking up um, pieces of painter tape. There's a couple other things that need picked up and cleaned up, but whatever. It's done. The house looks pretty. Everyone has has liked it so far. Just talked to our neighbors and they messed up our address on this paper. Oh, oh well. It's done. We just have to wait for the guy to do redo to do that siding. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, I'm glad it's done. And it's over with. Now we can get ready for company. And no more brown. Said the only beige left is in Kevin's office, but he hasn't decided how he wants it painted yet. So yeah, I think that is all for now. I will someone else is making a video. Um yeah, we will talk to you later got some vlogs I need to to work on got some stuff going on health updates on the child she's fine by the way just yearly checkups I got a dentist appointment next week and school to finish up next week and yeah got some fun stuff to talk about so for now we will talk to you later and we'll see, we'll see you real soon <laughs> bye uh, hello happy tuesday so today is august 27th just thought i would give you an update on the house painting since it's been all summer and i am outside dealing with yard debris before a trash pickup tomorrow whole long story about that other story whatever it's a possible hurricane coming and yard pickup is tomorrow and there's a storm coming tonight so someone's got to come do it um anyway back to the house end of june beginning of july the contractor finally came and repaired the siding 
up on the roof with the hole. Um, Saturday morning, didn't know he was coming. Anyway, didn't know he was coming to do it. Came like at eight o'clock in the morning, woke me up. I got woken up to pounding, had no idea. Okay, fine, he fixed the siding. Kevin called, checked in with everything, figured out when they're gonna come paint. Um, summertime, rainy season, hurricane season, track got a bunch of jobs lined up that they're trying to get through, so. We'll get to it when we get to it. Kevin sent a not so nice message Thursday, last week, about it. You know, this still hasn't been taken care of. We haven't heard anything from you. The gutter cap still hasn't been done. They called back, said they will be there eight o'clock Friday morning. All right, cool. Get done and over with. They didn't show up at eight. I held off on doing things all morning because I was waiting for them to show up. Kevin finally told me, go do what you need to do. I, my ringer's on, they can ring the doorbell. We'll figure it out, it's fine. He gets off of work at five. We start getting our, ourselves ready to go out, have dinner, do some shopping. We didn't even really do any shopping. We were looking for a new stove, um, which isn't fun. We went to Home Depot, Lowe's, and Best Buy. The most um, gas stoves we saw were four. Didn't even really like any of them. The one I really like is at Costco, and it's over two thousand dollars but yeah gas stoves are not popular so no one carries them but you can order one offline doesn't work for me I want to look at it and open it and check it out but anyway our oven is working it's having some issues we bought a thermometer we'll figure it out anyway we're getting ready to go 5 15 5 30 they finally show up to paint It only took 10-15 oh, minutes. Didn't take long, but just really, really frustrated. There was no communication, no, hey, I'm running late, no, nothing. So anyway, it's done. The gutter still isn't fixed. There are some things that I wish we had noticed when we did our um, walkthrough when they were done that I wish I could tell them, no, you need to do a better job at this. Such as this, right here. This. I don't want to see beige. But anyway, it is what it is. If, they, if we had had some extra white paint, I'd probably go through and paint it. We don't. So, yeah, that's our story. We're done. I uh, really want to take the sign out of the yard. No clue if, I don't think they've gotten any sales from the sign being up in the yard. It's been there all summer. I'm done, I want to take it out. So yeah. That's it. I guess I will show you the siding real quick. And then, yeah. We'll see how long this lasts. It's supposed to last quite a while. So, and they're supposed to come out and fix and t do anything if we have any work done. Like, we need to do, get the windows replaced. So if, if and when we ever do that, they're supposed to be come out and repaint 
for free. So, but for now, that's it. Let me turn you around, go outside, and show you. So, it's all done. No more holes. We spent all summer with two white pieces of siding. So, yep. That, I suppose, is the conclusion of our house painting story. Now I can get this video all edited. came back inside from the sunshine. You get this edited and uploaded here soon. Um, I was hoping to do it this week, but now we're in possible hurricane prep. <sighs> so much fun. Anyway, I need to get this pile of palm fronds cut up so it can go out tomorrow I haven't even started and I'm super hot. So yeah, for now, I think that's it. We'll talk to you again soon. So we'll see you real soon.